still in Wisconsin. It's a balmy 12 freaking degrees. Seems to be some kind of fuckery going on in the freeway. We're now passing through the Indiana wind farms. This is actually where wind comes from. These large turbines spin in a clockwise direction, making wind. It then blows across the country. unloading the van full of stuff at the Louisville blah 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 whatever convention center. I brought some water too. Alcohol is good. It keeps things clean. Yes. All right so there's a there's a big line of people waiting to get in so um, we're just we're just getting here now so but not a not a problem because there's like 8,000 million people um, piled up in in the hallway waiting for six o'clock before they let them in so uh, all right let the unloading begin this is always the best part of doing a show Okay, so we got one load in. Here comes load number two. Mark's working on securing it. So always the adventure. Um, but uh, I'm always amazed with how fast the show goes from being an empty room with nobody there to full of dealers completely set up in, in a, literally a matter of uh, 30 minutes. So it's kind of cool to watch. Cool shit going up already. All right, so here we are back at our tables. And as you can see, not a damn thing set up yet. Um, we've been wandering the show um, because again, the show is fantastic. Um, there's, there's so much stuff. Literally everything is here. Everything and everyone is here, which makes me wonder why you're not. Um, there, there is so much cool stuff to see. I don't care what you collect. If you collect Civil War, Revolutionary War, World War I, World War II, it, you're going to find some of it here. Japanese, German, Italian. I saw some cool Polish stuff. Kolegi uh, Popolsku. Um, just all kinds of stuff here. And uh, so if you, if you haven't made it yet to the show of shows in Louisville, I really recommend that you come down. Maybe not this week. Um, but in some time. And if you're close enough, come on down. It's cool. Uh, so I'm going to go look around some more and see what I can see. This has got to be one of the coolest things we've seen at the show so far. Yeah. It's a big Stuka size Stuka. And I, and I love the way he's got it mounted up there. I don't know what he's asking for it or what it's made out of. But it's pretty cool. All right, well, welcome to the uh, after action report. Uh, we're back in our hotel room, uh, fresh from day one of the show of shows. And uh, Mark and I were able to move all our stuff into the hall, so that was great. We didn't set anything up. We just wanted to get it in there so we knew it was in and safe. Um, and we're gonna set up tomorrow. Uh, we did a little bit of shopping. Um, didn't find as much as we would have liked, uh, but you never know. I did find, I found one thing uh, for the show of show challenge, um, and I was able to buy uh, an iron cross. So this is my first uh, foray. Um, so now I'm going to see if I can move this and, uh, and parlay that into more. 
Um, I did miss out, there, there was a real nice uh, regimental flag that I looked at. The price was a little more than I wanted to go, so I, I let one, a friend of mine know about it, and he bought it. Uh, but a very nice uh, regimental flag um, that, that was here, so that was cool. Um, what about you? Well, when you come to these shows and you find something you'd like to buy, buy it right away. <laughs> Don't come back. I found a, a nice M42 Luftwaffe helmet and uh, I look, looked at it, thought it was a good deal. But I had just started walking around, and it was one of the first tables I went to. And so then, after I looked around a bit, ah, I went back to it. Gone. So, today, I bought nothing. And I, I tell that to people all the time. Don't. If it was a good deal, it's not going to be there. And, lo and behold, it wasn't there. Yeah, the first night is so fast and furious with dealers setting up, putting out new wares, people going by, scooping, trying to find those deals, trying to find, you know, what, what they can either use for their own collection or what they can sell, uh, you know, for their markets. Um, I was able to find um, a nice 44th Infantry Division unit history uh, for uh, Rick. Um, one of our shop members who is actually watching the shop for us now. So, shh, don't tell Rick we got him this present. Um, and, uh, and actually one of my friends uh, reminded, this is how you tell a friend. One of my friends reminded me that he actually had an SS Hat Eagle of mine for about five years. And he had, uh, he gave it back. Um, so we were, uh, the, the interesting thing about this SS Hat Eagle is that they drilled holes, little bitty holes in it to sew it onto a hat. Uh, so, um, but, so that's always nice. So, shout out to Tom for doing that. Always appreciate that. So, that was the end of day one. Um, we'll try and get you a flavor of what's going on uh, tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow is actually more dealers set up in the morning and then they let the Ohio Valley military collectors uh, club members in at noon I believe um, and <laughs> can't get it without a bed um, so and then it's uh, so then it's club members in until the show closes at five or six whenever it closes um, and then Friday it's open to the general public and Saturday it's open to the general public and then Sunday morning, it's just the dealers again and club members uh, for takedown and move out. So I hope you enjoyed the update. Uh, we like having you along with us. Thanks to everybody who stopped us and said, hey, I like your videos. Um, you know, so it's always nice to meet people, especially people we don't know. I mean, we, we certainly appreciate all our friends who we've been seeing for years and years uh, at the shows. Um, but it's nice to hear from, we just had somebody call up the shop uh, the other night just to tell us that they liked, they liked us doing these videos. So we're happy we can share a little bit of what we're so passionate about with you um, because it's, this is all, it's history, it's important, it's worth preserving um, and we love sharing it with you and we love talking about it. So thanks for being a part of the journey with us and we'll see you tomorrow for day two of the show of show challenge, 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 challenge. Have a good night. Ciao.